What's going on guys? I'm getting a lot of emails about what track spike should I get. You know, I'm getting emails from athletes who say, hey, you know, I'm new to track. I don't know what spike to get. What do I get? Or I get, I'm getting a lot better. I want to get a specific spike. Which spike is the best? Um, now, each company makes different styles and the foot itself is tailored differently. So there are many types. There's Reebok, there's Adidas, there's Mizuno. All the above. I'm going to go through the Nike specifically right now because um, our school is sponsored by Nike and I had to learn a lot more about this specific brand so I know which shoe is the best for each athlete. Okay, so the overall athlete, if you're new, joining track, you're doing multiple events, you're not really sure what you're good at yet, you want to go with the Nike Zoom Rival ND. This is a universal spike. It has heel support for triple jump and all the jumps. It has a good um, plate to handle and absorb a lot of force for your sprints and jumps all around you want to go with the rival MD7 the shoe that I like the most for overall is the actual MD6 last year's version it's gonna be harder to find this because it's last year's version um, but a bonus is it's lower in price and it has a little more heel support I think this shoe is the best one overall compared to this year and last year but um, either way, you're not going to go wrong with the NB6 or NB7. Do not sprint. Check that. Do not jump in sprint spikes. You must leave the ground from a flat foot. Sprint spikes do not have the support for the heel when it comes to um, the design. This design is steeper to keep you on the balls of your feet, but there is no heel support. There are vital ligaments and tendons underneath your foot that you do not want to damage. Make sure you jump with jump spikes only. If you get specific, high jump spikes are really good. You need to have these if you're jumping over five feet for girls or over five, four, five, six for guys because there's a lot of demand in the foot. These will support that. There are spikes in the heel and the foot is flatter. They're a little more dense. They will help you jump a little higher. When it comes to triple jump specific, there's more heel support. This plate is a lot sturdier. It's designed to handle all the impacts in the triple jump. The long jump, these are designed for more of a sprint, designed to roll through. There is heel support, not as much as triple jump, but a lot more than the MD. If you specialize in long jump, you want to get these. If the world was perfect and everything was free and you did all three jumps, you would need to get long, triple, and high jump specific spikes. But if finances are an issue, you want to go with the long jump if you're specific in long jump, but you can go with the MD. If you do long and triple jump, always go towards the triple jump shoe because you can long jump in it. Okay? All right. So um, if you have any more questions, send me an email at info at and I'll be glad to answer more of your questions. All right, guys.